Liam, that was quite uh, quite an entertaining game from a neutral perspective, but how was it on the pitch today? Um, yeah, I think a bit of a relief, um, a bit of like, upset, you know, like the way we played wasn't at our best, but I think looking at the whole game, I think relief more than anything. Um, talk to us about your goal as well, it was a well taken penalty, wasn't it? Yeah, um, I think we did well. I think we should have scored before that, to be fair, but then John Daddy did well to get the rebound and keep it touched in, so yeah, it was... And from, from our perspective anyway, um, but that first goal for Sunderland, when that came out of the blue like that, how do you react to that on the pitch? Yeah, to be fair to me, it was a great strike, you know, that, that I can't really do much about it. Um, but I think after that we've just got to put our heads up and sort of keep going again and then not let it affect us too much. Was that the same mindset when we went behind in that case as well? Yeah, definitely. You know, um, we couldn't let it affect us too much because then that's when we start conceding the third and the fourth and then it just takes everything out of it. So it was good that we didn't let it affect us too much and we managed to get back in the game. And you came off at this point, but how were the nerves sat on the bench once uh, once Yann had scored? Yeah, I think, again, relief. And then after that, it just was a bit end-to-end game. You know? It was a bit like a computer game, which... For the fans, it was probably a great watch, but for us, it, yeah, it was nervous. And what would you say to the fans today? Because they made a lot of noise today, didn't they? Yeah, they've been excellent, you know, since, especially since the new manager come in. They, they've given us that extra 10%, so we're going to need them until the end of the season. And there's only one more home game left now, so there's, uh, there's not a lot of time for them to be able to do it, I suppose. Yeah, one, one final big home game, and yeah, we're going to need them. And for Sheffield Wednesday as well, they're, uh, they're a team that are sort of around us at the moment, but... It's uh, a week away still, but how are the preparations going to be this week? Yeah, you know, I think we'll go back in next week and sort of look towards that, you know, look how they play and how we're going to play against them and see how it goes.